everyone, it is Ree Chani here and it is almost the weekend, unless you're already watching this during the weekend, or that this is a very sad, sad Monday for you. Today's looks comes from a very, very cute anime, something that I haven't seen for a really long time because I watch pretty dark stuff. Dark, dark stuff. Like my soul. Well, the inspirational looks comes from Kobayashi-san no Chi, Meido Dragon. Karashi's Mage Dragons. Mage Dragons? Mage Dragons. It's just so cute and bubbly and a lot of boobage. The guys would enjoy the boobage, some girls would too. And the girls would enjoy the cutesy part, and some guys would too. And both genders and anyone else would just enjoy it all together. Let me show you the cute outfits that I have today with one anime, three styles. Let's go into a world of dragons. I wish, I wish with all my heart to fly with dragons. Wait, that's the wrong show. Kana, the cutie pie, is first up. With her look, I went super, super simple with just a dress. Now, this player dress is pretty fun, so don't take it so lightly. I picked this dress specifically because it matches her innocent nature. First off, let's look at the bunny button pin. It's got the silhouette of a bunny, a button attached to it, hearts, and a bow. It's very girly and childish, but ain't it cute? It's actual detachable pin, so you can remove it or pin it anywhere you want. It's also got these buttons running down the middle, and these flower designs all over the dress. The back class is with the button also, and I have to say it is super hard to attach, just a side note. And we got the strings to hold the dress together. And of course, on the side, there's another button just to tighten the arms. That's it for this look. Now, you can always accessorize it with more hair accessories, with proper shoes, or even wear it with a red bag. Yep, that's right. It's you, Tori. You're next. Wearing this dress made me super, super in high spirit. And once again, I went for the simple and sweet. This is an overall dress that you can see that's full body length shortly. It's got these random pockets in the front to store who knows what. You pop out your boobs more. Who knows? Then also got this fake bunny on the side that's just a flap. Turn her around just so you can see the back. The back is also covered by the overall which is held by two clasps. It's actually pretty snug around the waist but that's okay. And to top it off, I am wearing a plain white top that I can pair it with a red necklace to give that pop tie that Toru has. Let's look at it with a full effect. I paired her outfit with plain shoes. The brand is Circus and it fits like a charm. I'm not kidding. They have built-in insoles to make me slightly taller but also gives that extra support and cushion for your feet to feel satisfied and good. You could definitely do a lot more for this outfit but I thought simplicity was bliss. Last but not least, it's Rukula, the big melon beauty. I don't got the melons, but I got the style. This is my favorite look overall for this anime. First off, the hat. You can't see the design, so let me get a closer up for you. Anything embroidered is in right now. You got what I believe are soccer branches on both ends that kind of reminds me of horns. There's lettering on the side that says Peacemaker, but spelled wrong. Whoops. Pretty sure they meant Peacemaker as in P-E-A-C-E. -E. The back of this thing is also very nifty. It's not those plastic pop clasps, so I think it holds it all together all better. Simple is today's style. I have on a plain black tank that can leave free in Roman or you could just shove them into your shorts, your denim shorts. You can probably tell they're definitely extensions, but what's cool about these though is that the extension is a mix of brown and green. Yeah, that's right, but you can't tell which brown is my real hair. That's it for the dragons. Which one is your favorite? Thank you for watching. Please remember to subscribe, check out my other videos, or hit me up on any social media. Until next time.